Welcome to Anumanta Tech Talks, the series where we dive into the fundamentals of IoT. In today's episode, we're shedding light on the term eSIM. Ever since the introduction of the eSIM IoT SGP32 in 2023, the term eSIM has gained frequent attention. So let's delve into the top three common uses of the word eSIM in telecommunications. First on our list, we have the EUICC SIM, which is short for Embedded Universal Integrated Circuit. These SIMs enable remote provisioning of carrier profiles on IoT devices, eliminating the need for manual SIM swapping when changing carriers. It's a revolutionary step towards seamless connectivity management. Next up, we have embedded SIMs, which are often incorrectly referred to as eSIMs. However, an embedded SIM, or MFF2 chip, is simply a specific form factor for SIM cards, much like nano SIMs or 4FF. The MFF2 form factor is a non-removable SIM card that can be soldered directly onto the surface of a circuit board. This design provides a compact and integrated solution for IoT devices. And finally, the eSIM IoT or SGP32, the latest GSMA SIM technology standard. This innovation allows remote operator profile changes, streamlining and optimizing IoT management. By now, you should feel like an expert on eSIMs. But if you're hungry for more, head to the link below for a deeper understanding of the benefits of IoT eSIMs.